time you got up. I might have caught something. Jagged into that corpo's bio mod. No, no raw virus suit. Need to see Vic. Let him tell me what's got my head reeling and my stomach churning. Okay, let me take you. Aren't you right? Throw some threads, meet me downstairs. Gina Jones here. If you're looking for work in Watson, give me a call. How'd you find me? How'd you even know my name? I know where to gather my intel. Could even call me a collector. Later, B. 9999. Don't forget, you're with Piece of shit! Come on! How you like my new punching bag? Just gave me a next-gen ass whooping he did. Be curious to see how he handles the likes of me. So how about it? Nah, not today. Thanks anyway. Whatever. I'll be here. V, your sweet little 45 is waiting for his daddy. First after every shot now. Let's have a look. Thanks a lot. I've got no regrets. There's no shame in wanting perfection. Virtuosos and theatrical performances in the No tradition. The sponsor for the festival is the Arasaka Corporation, and in an exciting development, even Hanako Arasaka has announced her participation in the Ashi Parade. From all of the so. enough. Worked up an appetite, just waiting. Sit down, let me finish this. Then we can drop in on Senor Vector. Didn't figure you as a type for Asian. Would have thought you'd find it too exotic. What do you mean? What's there not to like? Noodles? Check. Synth sirloin? 
Check. Get some more Chile action up in here, and you're looking at Mama Well's signature sopa de fideos. <laughs> Mentioned something about a surprise yesterday. Am I remembering right, or just had it going for us? Probably both, because you usually forget shit. But it just so happens, I think I might have bagged us a sweet ass J O B. Go on. I mean, maybe it's not as big as that, but. Just that he's fronted by a little known someone named Dexter Deshaun, man. Only the top fixer in night fucking city. Fat ass black Jesus of the afterlife. 300 pounds of partly gold plated cool. Dexter Deshaun? What's the latest spec on him? I know you got info to spill. He's been off the grid for about two years. Word on the street was he took a little vacay. Two years? That's exile, not a vacation. What was he up to? Uh, guessing he shoved pizzas in his mouth while jerking off the hardcore virtues. The important thing is he's back. It's a fresh group. He found us. So what's the gig? We meant to come out in one piece? Our Lord and Savior wants to tell you everything himself, face to face. Oh, no pressure, but uh, this whole deal is right by you. Why do I gotta go? You and T-Bug draw straws without me? T-Bug and Dex go way back, and my face is yesterday's news. All Dex says he needs to check you, talk to you. Look, V, it's his job, his rules. I can't blame him for taking a personal approach. And it ain't as bad as you think, okay? Trust me. Guess I got no choice then. Dex is a real deal when it comes to fixers. Don't get me wrong, I don't got nothing against the Padre or Wakako, but Dex is in a league of his own. Man. Don't get me started on fixers. They catch a client, find the cheapest gong to do the job, then drop their corpse at a landfill. Shit, hit the nail on the head. Gracias, Dios. Lleno. Brought your wheels. Gave to my guy yesterday to smooth over the dents for our uh, dust up with the scans. Thanks, Jack. Much appreciated. Some top notch work Miguel did. Rides like it looks. Factory new. We'll see about that. So we rolling or what? Let's feel this factory new. on the gas, huh? I just ate. I was supposed to stop by Vic's anyhow. I got a date. Me you know what say? She's so sweet. Really gets me, you know? Find me once fixed on dust in your circuits. We'll hash out what Dex has cooked up for us. Sit tight over here. Me and Misty got a little kitchen up to do. <laughs> Vicky, surprise every old ripper. It's good to see you. Good to see you too, Vicky. A while. To what do I owe the pleasure today? Last gig. Had to jack into a client's neuro socket. Think I might have gotten spiked. Experiencing migraines, nausea, 
Hypersensitivity to bright lights. Whole kit and caboodle. All right, kit. We'll sort you out in a flash. Besides that, how are things? Met a new fixer. He gave me a job. Name's Dexter Deshaun. Known quantity from the afterlife. No denying you're moving up. But? Something you're not telling me, Vic? Keep your guard up, that's all. I've heard some things about Dex. He's not as chill as he makes himself out to be. Need some new kit, but tools, not toys, Vic. Time I bumped up my sights and got a grip. <laughs> really? Now? Finally? Vic, shit's getting real. Got a job from Dex to Sean, hitting the major leagues. Me tech that can perform. The Dexter Deshaun? <laughs> well, that is something. But let me guess. Hasn't paid you yet. Quit crying, Vic. I'll bring you the Eddies later, with interest. You know I will. Hmm. Last time, you hear? Chair, please. Sit down and relax. Kuroshi Optics. Best I've got, and should be about right under the circumstances. Now jack in. You peruse and choose while I scan. Let's see what's going on inside. Mark one, like I said. Decent enough scanner. Displays data on your cornea. Cherry on the top's a built-in external lens disruptor. In layman's terms, any surveillance cam will capture your face as a blur. Now just remember, your body will still show up as crystal clear. Hmm. This should do the trick. Talks to Kuroshi Tech, too. I'm ready. Carve away. Excellent. Let's do this. Lay that major league arm of yours right here. So, what's new in the life of Victor Vector? <sighs> yeah, if I'm being honest, not much. And that's fine with me. I used to live in a world where all that mattered was who's who, what's what, and how's why. And what happened? One day, I just dropped it and never looked back. I'll never be a legend in this town, but been sleeping nights ever since. Just like that. Thanks. Now, a bit of anesthetic and I can start cutting. Feel anything? Play by play, though? Really, Doc? Makes it sound like a dentist. Always going on and on. Don't be mean now. Remember, I'm old. I got a shaky Gannick hand. Could slip. Lights out for a minute, all right? Let's test this. See the magic in action. Linking you in. You might feel a little discomfort at first. Blurred vision, low contrast, glitches. Well, how's it look? Feel all right to you? 
Oh, this is fantastic, Vic. <laughs> oh, beautiful. For the scanner. It might take you a few seconds to adjust, but first time's really the charm. <laughs> with anything, really. Scanner should eventually sync with your thought processes and read your intentions. I also inject an NCPD file search. Run into any ne'er do wells? <laughs> you know exactly what they ne'er did well. <laughs> it ought to work like a charm. Now draw your weapon. You should see your ammo count in a brand new site. Shit, Victor, not bad. I don't know what to say. Say you'll take this and remember the dosage. Two whiffs now, and another two in an hour. What am I looking at? A mild stim. Should boost neurotransmission in the short term and muffle some of the side effects while the implant takes. Thanks again, Vic. You're the best. I owe you. Go on, kid. Show them what you're made of. And once you hit the big leagues, don't forget where you came from. a little out of whack, babe. I can release it for you, but you'd have to watch out for negative energy fields and avoid mean reds. V, and yo, listen up. I talked to Dex while you were in with the doc. He's waiting in his ride for you. Ain't but a hop to where he's parked next to Gramsci Burgers. Okay, do my best to talk us up. V, listen, I've got this delicate matter. That's why I called you. The number of cyber psycho attacks in the city is on the rise. Now that's probably not news to you, but this issue matters to me for a few reasons. There are people who say cyber psychosis can be treated. Right. And I know exactly how that sounds, but I believe even an unproven therapy is still better than a bullet to the brain. If I get a tip about a possible attack, I'll give you a call. Maybe you can investigate before Max Tack hits the scene. But remember, you're not there to execute anybody. Try to incapacitate the attacker, and I'll send someone to pick him up. I hope that's all clear. Hmm. Dexter Deshaun in the flesh. Ample indeed. <laughs> no flow. Mind if I ask you something right off the bank? Would you rather live in peace as Mr. Nobody, die ripe, old, and smelling slightly of urine, or go down for all times in a blaze of glory, smelling near like posies, without seeing your 30th? It's first place or no place, Dex. Cost isn't a factor. <laughs> Classic. I'd expect nothing less from eager, supple youth. Respect. All right, listen close. Scanning a serious job now. Playing gargantuan compared to smashing up a scav home. Let me hear it. What's the job? There's this prototype tech. A biochip to be precise. Jobs to grab it. Simple. Yeah. 
Guessing it belongs to a court. Mm-hmm. Arasaka. Surely that's no problem. Corps don't deserve special treatment. Shit, <laughs> you ain't playing around. Got a feeling this could be a start of a beautiful friendship built on heaps of eddies. You work this out? Got a plan? Two things. First, a conundrum with the Maelstrom boys. Needs active resolving that. Second, a rendezvous. Simple. Client who brought us the job's anxious. She wants to parlay with one of the team. Klein, what's her thing? Why she need to meet? Woman's name's Evelyn Parker. Betting her wasn't easy. Put the word out I was looking for any kind of intel. Right, and? Some brothers from Pacifica got back to me. Told me to stop looking. End of convo. <laughs> anyway, our little client insisted on meeting someone with skin in the game. You know, who'll be there for it all. Yours truly will be remote. T-Bug ain't no people person, and Jaggy's only good at some things. I know you know what I mean. Pretty much leave you. What's the issue needs resolving with Maelstrom? Got a beef? Slot in the shard. I got a classic tale for you. Psycho Gang doing his thing two weeks back. Jumped a Militech convoy. Got away with the gear. Corp don't even know Maelstrom's involved. Now see, Convoy was carrying the Flathead, a little combat bot, a prototype. And I need me that bit of high-grade military tech. Because if we don't get that bot, we don't get no soccer chip. And we sure as hell don't get no happily ever after. But don't get excited. It's a single-use toy. Now, I flat out purchased the damn thing from Maelstrom. The problem is, I did so from a gent went by the name of Brick. I say when, because Brick was the leader. Three days after we'd sealed our deal, his friend and gangmate, one Simon Randall, AKA Royce, plain dropped his ass. Royce is in charge now, and I got no way of knowing if he aims to honor his predecessor's word. To add to this shitstrom, one Meredith Stout of Militech has developed an interest in said convoy. Prima Donna. Corpo agent, internal affairs. Been skidding around town asking after the convoy as if her life depended on finding it. The one lead she's got zip tied in her trunk. Stick up her ass ain't growing any shorter. So she must be getting desperate. Be wise to think how you could use that. Of course, to do so, you'll need that frazzled cat's info. Sending it now. I think I got everything. Time I got to work. Well, that's just music to my ears. I'll set up the meet with Miss Parker at Lizzie's bar. Flathead, though, is gonna be all you. thing, Mr. V. This worked last time. Quiet life or blaze of glory? Hmm? Later now. Dexter, talk to Dex. 
Gordito's a big deal. Literally a nod, yeah. Guy certainly knows how to protect his biz. Wants to put us in a few small kinks. Prep work, I guess. Before lining us up a big job. There's this combat bot, military prototype. Maelstrom clept it. Then Dex paid to take it off their hands just before the gang goons had a switch up in management. Right, right, heard about that. Royce versus Brick. Hostile takeover. That sums it up. Dex wants us talking to Royce. Gave the deets of some Militech agent, too, but I don't know how much help she stands to be. Ha! <laughs> Chingon. Then there's the other thing. Gotta meet the client who put the job on the table. Evelyn Parker. You? Well, what's Dex gonna do? Ride around in his limo, chat chicks up on the hollow? Parker wants to meet someone on the crew. Dex gave me the nod. They must know what he's doing. So, how you want to play this? Maelstrom or Parker? What's first? I say we knock on Maelstrom's door first. Pound, actually. What I lay. In that case, I'll hit the all foods. My nose to the ground. It's the ground. Hasta luego. Just ah, there you are. Let me hear what you squared away. So Dex already paid the Maelstromers for the Corpo bot. Thing is, can't be sure the gang goons are still willing to hand it over. He paid up front? <sighs> well... Whatever. Let's go get this tech. You scheme yet? You got a plan? That shit can go smoothly. This is Maelstrom. Gang world ain't too complicated. Might's right. The strong survive. Either you fuck others, or you get fucked. So, into the Borg Beast then? Let's go see these bastards. All right, let's knock on their door. See if they even open up. I hate these pork fuckers. It's had to be them. Just a gang like any other, right? Take the Valentinos. They follow God and the Santa Madre. Honor means something to them. You know what they want, how they get it, and what pisses them the fuck off. With Maelstrom, you just never know. Go on, let them know we're here. Stout here. Start by telling me how you got this number. 
No more than your number. Heard you misplaced a convoy. You shut him up! Ring a ding ding, Chom. Gotta get this done. Spill what you know. Don't make me wait. Nuh-uh. Not on the horn. Let's meet. Cut a deal. A deal? Fine. Ring a ding First ding, Chom. Gotta get this done. The NID. Storm channel under the overpass. Meet you there. Ring a ding ding, Chom. Gotta get this done. <sighs> Don't know you. Wanna talk to Royce? Dex sent us. Main room. We've been waiting. Though. Oh, yeah. They look damn well prepared. Don't think I've ever seen security like this in the Chow factory. Yeah, gear from the Jack Convoy. Gotta be. Must have been all over it like maggots on dead meat. You hear about their boss, Royce? Dex mentioned him. <laughs> Called him special. Just Minas Holmes. Anti-personnel mine. Directional shrapnel spitter. My favorite. Subtle. See Royce. We got biz to transact. Mr. Royce is busy just now. You'll deal with me. You got a bot. Model MT0 D12. Call the Flathead. And? The hell you care? Guy I represent already paid brick for it. I'm just here for the pickup. I can talk direct to Royce if necessary. Nah, you talk to me. Name's Dum Dum. Now couch, planet. Full cognitive immersion with a Raven controller. 
pimped out prototype actuators made of titanium vanadium Kevlar composite. And watch this. Fully integrated link too. So when the spider starts crawling up walls dangling from ceilings. Mm -hmm. Could lose your lunch. So what you think? Yep, we'll take it. Free. Sure. Yeah. Let's see a cred. Brick got it. It's all paid up. Brick got it. Huh. I don't see any fucking brick around here, do you? Come on. Can't expect me to pay for this thing twice. And who the fuck are you to say what can and can't be? You'll pay twice, because I say you'll pay twice. Alright, you want the flathead? I better see some eddies. I'm talking to you! Seems as you already got the eddies for it. You want to offer us a discount. A big one. A discount? Fuck. You know, you never did say who sent you. Never did say who you're working for. Dexter Deshaun. That's who. Dexter Deshaun. The lord ass who punching animal fucked half a Pacifica. <laughs> he ain't dead. No. Nope. He's alive, well, and kicking. And he sends his regards. So you're gonna consider my offer now? Bang. Bring it, cocksuckers! Cut me a rat! Just get him, man. Fuerte, cabrón! Out of here. I'm dying for some fresh air. Hey, when they fail on his feet, ah, I can taste it. It's a production line. Plus, I thought you loved me. There ain't no other way.
Ladies and gentlemen, Jackie Wells.
got it! We're done! Uh. Begging, no debt, no corporal strings attached, and the flat. It's ours. <laughs> That's the way to do biz, V. Tough to argue. Yeah, cause I'm right. Always. Nice of you to notice. Love this town. A city of endless opportunity and brotherly hate. But if you got the cojones and you know how to use them, you can do damn near anything. Unless you catch a boy, stray or not. Even then, you go out with a bang, right? And the street will talk. The street will remember. You know. You can make heaps more eddies as a motivational speaker. Hold up, way. What now, Jack? What now? And now I go back. Find Misty. Do something to make me feel alive again. They could have shot us up good back there. No two ways about it. Risks come with the job, Jack. Ducked in time to avoid death's weeping sight again. Only right to celebrate, even though we get to do that lots. Don't forget to let Dex know we got his toy for him. Ahí lo veo. How things looking, Mr. V? Got the bot. And how'd it go? Run into any trouble? And what about the Militech angle? Sure, of course there was trouble. Royce couldn't have given two shits that you and Brick had shaken on. How'd you get him on board? You used the Corpo woman? Did it without Militech holding my hand. Didn't want to risk it. So how'd you get that cat Royce to hand over the flathead? Only way I know that always works. Brute force. You got some balls, Mr. B. What about the meet with Evelyn Parker? Still on the to-do list. Mm-hmm. 
That meat's the only thing that'll get you a chance at grabbing that chip. Park will be waiting for you at Lizzie's bar. Good luck. 